Hey everyone, Sam Burr here and welcome to the third and final tutorial video for the Green Cities expansion on Xbox and PS4. Just a quick reminder that all the content throughout the PC, Xbox and PS4 versions are almost exactly the same and don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more awesome content. So in today's tutorial I'd like to talk about some of the new ways to design an eco-friendly city, more specifically through the use of policies. The Green City expansion comes with four new policies, so let's check out the first one. Under services you'll find recycled plastics. This policy increases the efficiency of the recycling centers by up to 20%. By using this policy, you will get more out of your garbage service, require less service buildings overall, and there'll be less garbage trucks taking up your space on your roads. This policy would definitely go great with the new ultimate recycling plant found in the monuments tab. The next policy is electric cars. This basically forces the citizens to change their original cars to new electric cars. These new vehicles reduce about half the noise pollution of an ordinary car and as a result your sims will feel much much better and require less healthcare services. Combustion engine ban is another new policy which is closely related to the electric cars policy. The combustion engine ban reduces the amount of noisy traffic by banning all vehicles except for electric and service vehicles. However, if a combustion vehicle does have a destination within this policy area, they still will travel to it. You should also be aware that these two policies do take some time to have effect throughout your city. Last but not least is the filter industrial policy. Once enabled, this policy will slowly reduce the ground pollution generated by the industrial areas and will create a healthier looking surrounding area. And just before we wrap up this video, you also have several new unique buildings to place throughout your city. These include the Bird and Bee Haven, the Lungs of the City, and a few other really cool things to check out. I'd just like to thank Paradox Interactive for this opportunity to make these tutorial videos. And as always, I'm Sam Bird. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more content, and I'll see you guys later.